Hey y'all, it's Taryn. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video. So I feel like this spot you're going to see a lot of because the light here, I've got the blinds open. It's just a lot of, it's only natural light. And I feel like it just looks so much better than all of those artificial lights in my filming room. So I'm headed out to shop free people. So let's back up a minute. I was scrolling Instagram as I do all the time the other night and saw that Rosie Blair on Instagram, though I always think of her as Rosie Be Me because of how her like profile name is on there. But anyway, I was scrolling through, saw a video that she posted where she talked about free people and sizing and the fact that she is plus size and she can wear some of the items. So I'll put the video here. Well, let's put the video here so that you can watch it. Is that Maya? Yeah. Can you feel it? Yeah. Let me see, right up. Oh, what size is that? 20 F9, 100. Uh, no. No, it's a, okay, baby. So I saw that and thought, wait a minute. We're kind of the same size. I'm more of like a 20, sometimes 22. Tw it just depends on brands. We all know that. But she's plus size. I'm plus size. And I felt like, you know what? I have never tried free people ever. I've seen uh, like straight size bloggers and YouTubers that I watch talk about it all the time. But I know the sizing is small, medium, large, sometimes extra large and some items. So I thought, you know what? My Belk here in town actually has an entire free people section, like with a really pretty sign, like it's a whole in itself section. I'll show you when we get there. So I went to Belk's website, filtered to my store. It would only let me select a size large as the largest size, but it showed like 75 items. The day that you're watching, like the video that you're watching scroll, it showed me it had, my store had 75 items. The next day, it was like 101 items. So all in a size large in my store. So I wanna go in and see what they have, but I put off filming this video because in that Instagram reel that Rosie did, she mentioned in the comments or maybe even in the caption that she was actually going to do a haul and see how sizing works. So her Instagram reel is up. I will put it here so that you can watch it. Free people does not make plus sizes intentionally, but that doesn't mean that plus size people cannot fit into their clothes. I'm a size 24. This dress, I'm obsessed with it. This is an XL, lots of ruching. This is a thermal maxi dress. Really cute button details right here. Sanderson sisters, like witchy girl vibes. I got this oversized thermal jacket. I am a size 24 slash 3X. This is only an XL at Free People and it's still oversized on me. So as she mentioned, she's a size 24 3X and she was able to wear the extra large with a lot of room. You saw that video. Now again, my store didn't allow me to pick extra large as the size large was the largest size, but I'm hoping that we still have some luck. So we're going to go in store. We're going to try some stuff on. Hopefully some things work. I know free people is a little bit pricey as well. So there's that, but we're going to go in and we're going to try some stuff on. We've made it to Free People, so it's quite a big section. See the sign there? All of these things. So, I guess we're gonna just start pulling some things. Again, like I mentioned, they didn't have, like extra large wasn't an option to pull or to search online. So I guess we'll just see if they even carry that in store. So I managed to get quite a few things, most of them are either in a medium or large. These were the only pants that I felt like could m even possibly work. Um, but we do have a couple of dresses, like this tee is in a large. These are really pretty. So I made the mistake of just wearing bike shorts <laughs> and not thinking in my head that I needed some sort of jean or something to try everything on with. So let's do, let's do these. Well, you know what, I have a romper. So let's do the romper first see if it works and then we'll try these pants with the tops and maybe they'll work. So this romper is in a size large. I'm pretty sure it's meant to be a little bit more oversized, but this is how it looks on me. I don't know how I feel about the longer in the middle shorts with the shorter on the side. It does have pockets. It's very comfortable. It says it's part of their like intimates collection. So I assume maybe it's meant to be lounge wear, like pajama wear. Kind of looks like I'm wearing a diaper down there but again this is in a size large very comfortable yeah I, 
probably won't get it because of this. I feel like it's just, it's not comfortable for me, but overall, I like the color. I like the idea of it. Update the pants don't fit. So I think that the hips and legs and everything would be fine, but this drawstring doesn't stretch very much. But I have this dress on. This is actually in a size medium. You can see it's pulling a little bit right there. So I think had it been one size larger, it would probably work a little bit better. But I felt like it was a very fall dress. The color with the tiers, the buttons all the way down. The length is good. It feels nice. It's kind of cute. Could be cute with booties or maybe a long cardigan. Again, this right here. It's just a little bit too small, but you maybe could wear um, like a bralette or something with it. I'm very surprised. Again, this is a size medium. So these two dresses didn't work for me. They're both in a size medium. This one wouldn't work, I think, because it has this slip underneath that just didn't fit. Had it not had this slip, I think everything would stretch and be fine. This one just didn't work for me. This like crocheted bit wasn't stretchy enough. Also, I think it's a dress. It's very short, could be a shirt, maybe a tunic length with some skinny jeans or leggings. But again, this one, both of them, size medium didn't work. But this is so cute. So again, I just put my bike shorts back on. So this is in a size large. It is the softest material. It is a little bit pricey. It's 148. But the length is really nice, a bit of a high low, shorter in the front, longer in the back. Size is actually really, really good. Fits nice, feels nice. I like the raw hem look of it there. Oh, you can't even see, there you go. On the sides and like on the arms, mock neck. This is cute, even with leggings, could be cute. I also grabbed this tan cable knit one. It's a little bit shorter. Um, a little bit more fitted on me also in a size large, though the sleeves are long enough. Um, the fit is fine. It's just a tad bit cropped. I like the different designs on the front of it. Could be cute with jeans. Picture it with jeans. Not with bike shorts, but with jeans. Um, could be cute. Fit, fits nice. Feels nice. Yeah. Not bad. I just wish it was a little bit longer. Had it been maybe an extra large. It would fit me lengthwise how I would want. It's just strange to me, like look how long the arms are. Maybe it's meant to be oversized, but obviously on me it's not. I did grab a couple of t-shirts as well. So both of them, I'm pretty sure, yeah, they're both in a size large. This one is like a very light. I mean, like you can basically see straight through it, the black shorts with the bra, but I liked that the pocket had a cute little floral detail on the inside. It's very much like a worn looking t-shirt. Curved him there. It's very long. It's very soft. It's very comfortable. How much is it? $58. <laughs> um, but if you need it, maybe if it wasn't in white, like maybe if it was a darker color, then you could wear it with the bike shorts or something like that. But the white one was the only one that I saw anyways in my store. I would sleep in this. I mean, for that price, I wouldn't. But you know what I mean? Like, it's that sort of material and feel that it's very comfortable. And I would definitely sleep in this. Next, we have this one. Again, in a size large. This one, I actually kind of really like. So pocket here, it's got the torn neck, some holes here and on the arm. I'll turn around and show you the back in a second. But I think that the fit is nice. It feels nice, the length is cute. I'd probably wear it with jeans. Front tuck it with some sneakers or black booties if it's cooler outside. I really like this one. Yeah, this is very cute. I know it's not gonna be everyone's cup of tea, but I like it. Here's a look at the back, also very torn. That's the tag sticking out, but you can see the holes and the distressing and stuff in the back and the length of it. Okay, two more items. I thought that some of y'all would like this one because of this bit at the bottom. The side is really cute. Open like that, the sleeves are cute as well. This one's in a size large. A bit of a tan oatmeal-y color. I like that it's almost like a t-shirt look at the top. That's kind of what it feels like as well. But then it comes down to this curved hem at the front, quite a bit longer in the back. This one would be cute with 
skinny jeans and like tall boots. And then here's what it looks like from the back. So very long and you've got that hem detail there. And this is the last top. This one's also in a size large. They had a lot of them like this style, just different patterns. So we pulled this one. I think it was probably the only one in a large. Um, it's a very fall look. It's got a cute little ruffle here on the sleeve. I feel like the neckline could be like this. You could pull it off the shoulder like that because it does have that elastic band all the way around. So this one's cute, just a little bit cropped, but if you had some high-waisted jeans or something, you could tuck it in. It definitely re reminds me of something I would see at Old Navy. Okay, I am home. I did make a purchase. That door's open back there. The cat goes in the garage and she's indoor only. Side note, if you care about this. So she's indoor only. She doesn't go outside whatsoever. But whenever I park in the garage, like the garage door is closed, but the house door is open, she goes out there and I feel like she thinks that she's outside and it makes my heart happy. that she like gets a little bit of free time, like free-ness before coming back inside. All right, so a couple things I did purchase. I spent a little bit of money. We know free people's not super inexpensive. So there's that. I ended up buying this gray shirt with the holes in it. I really liked this. It was funny, the woman at the register who was checking me out, she said, oh no, there's a hole in this. <laughs> and I said, I know, and she was joking though, but I thought it was funny. The back of it, again, this one's in a size large. I really liked it. I felt like I could get a lot of wear out of it, um, especially in the cooler months. For some reason, I feel like it would look really cute with like black skinnies, black boots, a black cardigan. That's just what I'm seeing for that item. And then I did buy this big, super soft sweater. Now this one was the pricier item, but it is the softest. How much was it? It was 148. Mm-hmm, it was 148. But the fabric is 76% nylon, 16% viscose, and 8% polyester but it is the softest material. So I'm very excited about this one too. I wonder um, if Free People's website, if I were to purchase from there, I bet they go up to an extra large because then some of the items might've just fit a little bit better. Uh, but I feel like I had a pretty good haul for y'all. I hope you enjoyed it. So my thoughts, I am a US size 20, sometimes 22. We've talked about sometimes 24, sometimes 18. It just depends on the brand, but pretty much a size 20 across the board. And these items work for me. So I hope that that helps you. I hope you enjoyed this video. Everything that I tried on, if I can find it, I'll link it in the description box down below. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Be sure to hit the subscribe button. And hopefully I helped you to find a new brand that maybe sells something that's super your style that you didn't know would work for you. I feel like Free People is very like boho whimsical almost. So if that's your style and you hadn't tried it in the past and we're similar sizes or your plus size, then maybe it will work for you too. So thanks for watching this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.